Askren. He has a fight coming up with, you know, with Jorge. How do you see that fight going? Oh, you said his name backwards. You said it wrong. It's it's Ben Askreem. Is that really it? Yeah, that's the 37-year-old Napoleon dynamite-looking virgin. That's the one who uh, used science and test tubes these days to get kids because he's a virgin still. But he has kids. Yeah, exactly. Science. So let me ask you this. You know, you're coming at me hard. I'm going to come at you hard. You're standing there with that shiny belt on your shoulder. Do you actually consider yourself the welterweight champion of the world? Because I'm pretty sure Tyron Woodley actually lays claim to that. Nah, he doesn't lay claim to nothing, man. This is my belt. I'm the undisputed champ. Tyron Woodley, he's been hiding, man. We were supposed to fight, Bispin. Whether you want to say it, look at the facts. UFC offered him the fight last December. He's hiding. He's been ducking everybody in the division. He doesn't want to fight. I'm here to make the division great again. And you know what I'm going to do by making the division great again? I'm going to the White House. I'm putting this on Donald Trump's desk. Do you have the invite to go to the White House? Or is that just another, you know, fragment of your imagination, like being the champ? Uh... The only figment of my imagination is you must not be seeing right with that one eye. Well, you have to admit, though, Kamara, like the, the, those, those um, tuxedos that he's been wearing, those are sweet, right? You have to admit, like that, that's a nice looking suit. Which ones? The ones, the bed sheets that his mom dressed him up before the press conference? Stop. <laughs> Come on, the one with the flower? I mean, I got to Like, those are nice. Come on. You got to give props where it's due. Oh, I, I can't give no, no. No props to that. That's embarrassing. He's embarrassing himself. We spoke to Raquel Pennington on Saturday. She said that uh, she didn't really enjoy the experience being next to you at the press conference. I don't know if you saw those comments. Yeah, I mean, I mean, but why does she not enjoy the experience? Did she did she not enjoy it because of my words, or did she not do it because her wife used to sweat me at American Top Team? There's a reason Tisha Torres left American Top Team, Mario. She used to sweat me. She was all googly eyed over me. Honestly, I'm pretty sure Ricky Pendleton walked in on Tisha and she was sweating me from Instagram and, and now she's mad at me. I mean, I mean, look at this. Twisted Steel and American Sex Appeal, baby. I mean, like, what do you want me to say? Like, I can't. But Tisha, at the end of the day, I only take sevens and up. So get out of here, man. I'm not dealing with you, Tisha. Did Donald give you any career advice? Did he give you any sort of parting words that are going to stay with you forever as you enter this next chapter in your life? Yeah, he told me to keep melting those CNN fake news soy boys. Stop it. He didn't say that. Yes, he did. Up <laughs> the palms, and I'm waiting in the buffet line, Ariel. I'm just trying to get some crab legs. Can the man get some crab legs? Can the man, the champ, get some crab legs in peace? And all of a sudden, low energy Marty comes, that terrorist rat Ali comes, and some other Sasquatch, and then they start pushing and swinging and putting innocent, dangered, Innocent kids' lives in danger and a pregnant lady. You know, there's a pregnant lady. She's screaming, I'm pregnant. Stop this. And Ali's still pushing, trying to make a scene. Uh, Usman's still trying to scream at me. Oh, I'm going to get you. And his little Sasquatch is like throwing punches at my friend and is, is trying to punch me. And it, it, I mean, it's a complete joke. You know, I can't believe that, you know, they allow that in Vegas and just a bunch of filthy animals. I'm in the cage. Colby, 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 let me ask you a question. What is it about Kamaru's game that makes you think you can beat him? He sucks. Where's he good? He's not good. At, hey, he beat my sloppy seconds after I already beat him. He beat guys that he, were left for dead. Rafael Dos Anjos, Damian Mott. I left them for dead. He came and picked up the scraps after me. He's really? a joke. He's nobody. Really? He's following in my footsteps. If I make a sandwich tomorrow, he's going to try and make the sandwich the same way. Kamaru <laughs> And I get pushed and, and ladies start screaming, oh, I'm pregnant, stop this, don't do this here. There's a bunch of little kids that are like screaming in the background and, and here you got Ali coming over here acting like he's a fighter. I'm like, yo, chill out, dude, you're not even a fighter. I mean, maybe you're one in 15 as a fighter, but you're not a real fighter. And then, you know, Marty, he should be on his little victory tour of winning his number one contendership fight, but he's all getting hostile. And by the way, you know, it's pretty funny, Ariel, he was claiming to have some broken foot. He looked all fine, mighty yesterday, jumping rails, trying to get in my face. So, 
You know, uh, some more fake news from him trying to say he was all hurt with his foot and he had a hernia. He looked mighty fine trying to trying to fight me in the buffet line at the Palms yesterday. Well, well, we're face the videos, face. You don't want to fight Nazgun. You're standing in between How many times you dug right me? Here. How many times you dug me? You don't want to fight me. Name when I ducked you. Hey, name you want to fight me when I had fights to fight Woodley name every single time. Name one. Every single time. Go ask my manager, Dan Lumber. You see, you think Dan Lumber's a manager? I'm asking you. Name one time. He's my manager. Name a time. Every single time. Name a time. Every single time. Guys, guys, guys. Last three months, you've been doing Question for you. Question for you. You mentioned Madison Square Garden. So that's an ideal time frame for you to fight in November Kamara. Is that a possibility? It's a, it's a possibility tonight. Let's do it you tonight. Let's do it right now. Let's, Let's go right now. Let's go right now. You, you suck, man. bro. Let's, Let's do, do it right now. Look, look at that. Look at you that. You suck. He talked. What was going on between you and Kamaru? I have to admit, at the end of that press conference, I wanted to see that fight more than the RDA fight. That was great stuff back and forth between you two. I mean, it's, he's just a thirsty hoe sweating me. You know, he's he's there that he's there to promote his fight, Ariel, and he's marking out and he's just promoting me. He's giving his time to talk about me. So, you know, he's talking about us being 20 miles apart. We're 20 miles apart in the rankings and 20 miles apart in skill level. I mean, the guy's JV in everything he does. You know, I mean, he's a complete joke. His mom dressed him up in bed sheets for the press conference. I mean, that's a joke. And then backstage, oh, hey, hey, he gets his buddy. Hey, turn on the camera real quick. We're gonna get a little. We're gonna get a little beef with Colby. I want move this low. He don't want no smoke standing next to me, so you might want to make him. In Chicago. <laughs> I might want to move this little guy. You don't want no smoke that next to him. Staring at the phone. Yeah, that was Brian. I'm going to walk out to this Look down. It's a good boy. We only talk on Twitter. We don't talk, we don't talk in person. We talk on Twitter. So just look down. Yeah, talk to everybody else. I'm right here. You can talk on Twitter, right? You can talk to me face to face. I'm standing in front of you. Talk. That's what I thought. Twitter thug. What? Say something. Come on, guys, come say on. something. Say something. No, you're looking at your phone. Say something. I'm in front of you. Talk that shit you want to talk on Twitter. Talk that shit. What? Who you, who, what you do? What you do? You ain't done nothing. You ain't done nothing. No, no, I know. I'm just talking to you. I'm talking to you. Follow your lead. Come on, come on. Come on. Hey guys, you guys, you had enough of this. What have you done? You haven't done nothing. You haven't done nothing. That's why they, they got you by yourself. You're not safe. You're not safe out here. You're not safe. You're not safe. You live 20 miles away from me. We got mutual friends. If it's if it's beef, we can do that. You know that. You know it. You know it. Be quiet. That's what I thought. We live 20 miles away from each other. Right, we right can meet up. You're right at we can meet up. So Khabib, you're lucky I'm sure you can look right over me. You got Twitter it's fingers. Right. You just want to talk on Twitter. He's a Twitter thug. He's tough on Twitter. He ain't tough now. That's what I thought. Do you ever run into Dean over at ATT? No, never. I, I don't, I've i never seen him here. You know, I, I come in on my own time. You know, I, I do my stuff on my own thing. He's... He's too big. He's not even a coach to, to the fighters, really. He, he coaches, like, the amateur women's program here at American Top Team. So, you know, he's, he's more useful for a mop to be our janitor. <laughs> <laughs> Do you feel like people sort of paid attention to your performance as much as they should have? Yeah, absolutely they paid attention. Uh, let's be honest there. I got a call from the President of the United States of America after the fight. What has Marty Fake Newsman ever got a call from? The chief tribe of Nigeria with smoke signals? <laughs> Marty Fake Newsman! Well, I don't want to wait till November 2nd, Madison Square, do it. It's Madison Square Garden. We can do it tonight. We can do it right now. Where you at? Where you at? I'm coming for you. You're doing it right now. The night's still early. Where you at? But 
you know, you're standing here and you're you're kind of talking now. When did your balls drop? Because they the only thing you're losing drop. faster than your hairline your is that Power drop? Ranger belt. When did your balls drop? Power Stop Ranger faking belt. injuries. Is oh, you're out for eight belt? months with you're out with eight months with a hernia injury. It takes six weeks of recovery. Stop faking injuries. You're the Tyrone Woodley 2.0. Eight months, right? That's right. March. Let's oh, hey, remember when you were, hey, remember math, when right? you were in a wheelchair after your fight? In the yeah. post fight? Yeah. yeah, and then you were jumping the barriers at, at the palms trying to get in my face. And what happened? Oh, yeah, fake. What happened? Hey, what happened? What, happened? what, what about that you wheelchair? Up, I thought you, you were hurt. I thought you like were hurt. You fake injuries, fake you excuses. Up your phone you're soft, dog. I'm you're soft. I'm soft. You're nothing. You know what? You get a call from the president today? You get a call from the president? That's right. You're a loser. No one gives a about you. Everybody came to see me, so shut your mouth and listen to the champ. What you what you care about the is champ. getting a call from the, the president? Champ. All right, well, first the of champ. all, can, no I, can I ask you a question? What happened there, and if, if Colby, if that's, uh, you know, any less special to you or any less exciting for you to, to not, you know, get to go down to Brazil again and, and try to try to repeat the performance? Yeah, I'm the king of Brazil, you know. I owe it to the Brazilian fans to go back there and put on a show for them, you know. The stock, you know, the thing is, is that Brazil wasn't ready for me, so Dana and had to put it in the U.S., Shut your bitch ass up. You went tough backstage. Yo, you put, you got 30%, you put 100% of the fans to sleep, motherfucker. When you see somebody like Kobe get a title shot, how's that make you feel? <laughs> oh, man. He don't deserve a title shot. Besides Damian Maya, who else? Nobody. And when I asked to fight him, he doesn't want to fight me. Keep and using your time funny. to promote me. That's why you're a mark, bitch. Yo, yo you want to talk? You talk Junior, trash settle down, Twitter. Junior. See, we lift. You, you ain't know? ready for prime time yet, son. We lift. You ain't ready for prime time. That's why you're on digital cable, boy. I'm on pay per view. We Sit live, your ass down, we Junior. We live 20 miles apart. We live 20 miles apart and we have mutual friends. If it's beef, we can do it. And no all one day. gives a fuck about you. Dana White, all damn, day. no one cares about you. You're a nobody. Get a you rank do. win, then come haul at me when you get a rank win. You do. Hey, you weren't talking all this trash backstage just now, were you? You acting real tough out here in front of the media. Everybody know you fake. If it's beef, we can do it. We live 20 miles apart. 20 miles apart. And we got mutual friends. We can meet right when we get back. It's not a problem. See, don't talk big out here in front of all these people. You know you're not about that life. You know that. If you was about that life, you would have hollered at me backstage just now. You're not about that life. Talk tough up here, but you know I will finish you. Yo, you ain't finished one fight, dog. You're a nobody. You just got dropped in your last fight by a nobody. Like, the guy's not even ranked and he's dropping your ass. You had to wrestle hump and fucking bore all these fans. That's why you're I not got on dropped. you yet. You're oh, a nobody. Oh, okay, okay. Think but uh, uh, cable, Junior. But I beat the shit out of the guy that nearly took your life in the first round, the right? The guy that choked your ass out, that right? knocked out. Nearly took you your life. got choked out by Jose you see that kind of tap you're that a nobody. He did. That You're was a nobody. type for dear life because he was no about to die about in there. Scam room, no one cares about you. You're a junior. Oh, really? You can holler at me backstage after this, too. Let's find out. You wish you had what I had, boy. I got zeros next to my, my bank account. You ain't got nothing. You fighting on the prelims still. <laughs> my next question.